And welcome everyone to England's Northwest. The action soon to get underway here at Old Trafford. I'm Derek Ray and delighted to have Stuart Robson sharing commentary duties with me. And it's the second leg of this round of 16 tie in the UEFA Europa League. It is Manchester United taking on Sevilla. Well, United have a slender lead, Derek, from that first leg. But unless they stay focused today and don't drop too deep, this could be a really tough game for them. I'm looking forward to this one. The lineup for Manchester United. David De Gea stands between the posts. Bruno Fernandes plays with Casemiro in the centre of the pitch. And the responsibility of leading the line today goes to Marcus Rashford. And this is how Sevilla will line up. Yeah, the same formation and the same sort of game plan. So this will all be about which individuals can get the better of their opponent. This will be a tough battle. second leg of this Europa League round of 16 tie. Ericsson. It's with Martinez. It's a fine United move in the making. And in with a real chance. No hiding from the fact that they really should have extended their lead. Well, that was a poor miss. Could they come to regret that? Well, sometimes you have in your ranks a player who can decide any game, and Jadon Sancho falls in that category. Stuart, what do you anticipate seeing from him today? I would describe him as majestic when he's playing at his best. He glides past defenders, he's got that ability to run with the ball into open space. And that's fantastic goalkeeping to get across and deal with the danger. Who can he pick out? Well, the keeper made that look relatively easy. In truth, it wasn't. And given away. Outrageously skillful. Rashford. It might be. Nicely saved. And over from Ericsson. Well, it was a crowded penalty area, but the keeper's done well to hold on to that. Plenty of running room in the wide position. In position. And the keeper more than equal to it. 
Well, the crowd are willing them to score here. They've created so many chances. So the corner played into the box. Oh, goal! He's going to be rightly proud of that moment. Sensational! Well, just look at this piece of skill. He times this absolutely perfectly. Great connection as well. We'll see this for years to come. Fantastic goal. Well, now on aggregate, 2-0 they lead. Good-looking ball. Gomez. A really top-notch piece of defending. Anthony. United being afforded too much space. Takes the shot. Oh, commanding goalkeeping. <laughs> and now the delivery. Still not clear. Casimiro, on to Bruno Fernandes. Can he make it count? And there is the goal! He's found the net, joy unconfined. Well, here it is again, and the clearance just isn't good enough. Giving up possession in a dangerous area, just poor defending all round. Pretty convincing looking aggregate score of 3 0. Alex Tennis. Sevilla struggling to keep the ball. Got the right idea with that pass. Jesus Corona. Here's Tevez. That is a very fine challenge in difficult circumstances. Well, the counter chance looks very real. And that puts them in position. Rashford is through. Just cleared away in the nick of time. And the referee allowing advantage to accrue to them. There to win it back. Ericsson. And Rashford. Gorgeous pass from Rashford. And a goal! Well, it looks easy when you can put them away like that.
Well, here's the replay, and this is what you're always told as a kid. Go for the far post, make it difficult for the keeper, and then hope your teammate is ready for any rebound. He does exactly that, and they get their reward. What a good goal that was. Well, it's turned into a runaway on aggregate, 4-0. Fine ball from Ericsson. The crossbar got in the way. And there goes the whistle. That closes the book on the first half here at Old Trafford. It is the second and decisive leg of this Europa League round of 16 tie. And the second half begins here. It's going to be United's free kick. Well, no card, but the referee clearly indicating that he's on his last warning. Van der Beek Joao Felix running with the ball confidently and it's played into the centre and keeping it out So the corner played into the box. Oh, it's gone in! And that will be written down as an own goal. No wonder he's hanging his head. Well, here it is again, and he's a bit unfortunate, you have to say. But it will count as an own goal against him, I'm afraid. A lopsided contest, 4-0. Felix. Well, this could pose problems for the defenders. Well, nearly shaving the crossbar with that powerful effort. Well, just to point you in the right direction, we have more live action from the Premier League coming up here on EA TV. It's Manchester United taking on Newcastle United. Donny van der Beek. Bruno Fernandes has it. Casemiro. Joao Felix. Fernandes. Well, not the greatest pass, easily intercepted. Bruno Fernandes. On to Van der Beek. The supporters want to see him have a go. position blocking it he'll be delighted to have won the ball having made that difficult challenge Jesus Corona determined defending 
Joao Felix. Well, that's a well-timed pass. Rafa Mir. Well, time just challenged magnificently. A quarter of an hour remaining here. He read the situation defensively and did his job. Racing forward, trying to catch them out. Oh, what an opportunity! And a decent save, full credit. And taking it away. Sancho. It's with Mikel Marino. And the referee felt he had to blow the whistle. And they're making a change. Sancho into the advanced position Bruno Fernandes corner given to United Can someone get on the end of this? No problems grabbing hold of that one. Casimiro failed to hang on to it. We've been waiting to find out. Now we know a minimum of three added minutes here. And the pass could do damage. He might be able to make it through. It's a superb save. The final whistle and Manchester United move on. Well, you can't say they didn't deserve it. They were by far and away the better team over the two legs and the result was never much in doubt. I'm sure they'll face a sterner test in the next round, but they'll be full of confidence off the back of that performance. Well, we're highlighting him for a reason, Stuart. He's put in a really authoritative performance here. Yeah, I think the only thing you could question could he have been a touch more clinical in front of goal? Maybe should have had two or three today. Regardless of that, it was a good performance and a great result.